Hello guys, I'm Rosie of Rose Greenery. I am a plantita from Kansas City, Philippines. Welcome to my channel. For today's episode, uh, it is very special. I am here in Arids and Aroids a Festival here in Newport, uh, Manila, Resorts World. So I got invited by a friend to check out the festival and I'm gonna give you a tour and let you know, I promise, I'll try to check out the plant names and the price range, okay? So just sit back, relax, and enjoy the tour. Hi, so 
big one. Look at my hand. <laughs>
Ano pong goal itong uh, Arid and Aries Festival? Uh, ang goal naman is to introduce new plants. Lalo na yung sa mga in plants ngayon. Mm -hmm. Now we are introducing new plants from South America na nilulok ng ating mga uh, plantitos, plantitas, tsaka ng mga millennials. No? Nice. Andito sila ngayon, yung mga plants na hinahanap nila. Actually, iba wala pa mga pangalan eh. Mm. Pero we have it here. Wow. Yeah. So what's the best advice you can give sa mga plant enthusiasts? Yung sa mga, yes, sa mga advice ko sa mga enthusiasts, uh, yung mga starter, no? yung lalo yung starter, Grow with ano, easy, easy plants muna before getting into yung mga non-easy para hindi masakit pag magkaroon ng problema yes, doon sa plant exactly. natin. So gradual, gradual, pag magaling na kayo doon sa easy plant, pwede na mag-level up. Pick your target. Dahan-dahan, no? hindi pwede magmadali kasi eventually pag dadaanan nyo yun. So kailangan talagang uh, uh, hindi pwedeng shortcut. Yun. Yes, yep. And also, um, how do we contact you in case uh, people are interested? Yung iba na nangihingi ng advices, free po ang advice na mga galing sa akin. Wala pong charge. Just let me know, send yung picture ng plants. Tapos, lalo na po yung proper care, proper soil mix na gagamitin. Marami po kasi yung gumagamit ng mga maling soil mixes. Although tribe naman po yung halaman. Ang importante lang, ang hindi kasi maganda, yung growth nila kung mali po yung soil mix na ginagamit. Then, yung application po ng fertilizer, yung application po ng, ng mga insecticides at condition. So, let me know po. Uh, I'm, I am much more than willing to help. Nice. Uh, so, you guys can visit their uh, nursery in Sila? Yes. And you also have a uh, nursery in Bulacan? In Bulacan. Mm -hmm. Apo. Yeah. Nice. Alright guys. Thank you very much po and see you. Thank you sir. So, hey guys, so I'm back here at home. I'm uploading this video on the 26th, so uh, the festival is until the 30th, Monday, which is a regular holiday for us here in Filipinas. So if you are near the area, I would really recommend you guys uh, visiting the festival. It's located in Newport Mall at the Shorts Road, Manila. But of course, you still have to take precautions. Don't forget to wear your face mask and shield and also bring your alcohol. More than 1,000 plants have been prepared by the Arid and Arid team for this festival and a lot of the plants are only made available to the public during this event. And even the rare and premium plants they have, they were only released for a couple of days last November 21st and 22nd. So we were so lucky we got to visit last November 22nd. That's why most of the plants showcased on this video are the uncommon and, you know, extremely rare plants. And these plants, the Arid and Arid team have been collecting them for the past uh, 10 to 20 years. The good powers po pag-aalaga nila dyan just, you know, to maintain and propagate and reproduce these beautiful plants. And as per Sir Boyet, some of these plants don't even have proper names yet. So, you know, nakakatawa talaga that they had them on the festival. And let's also recognize the effort of the team in preparing and bringing these plants to the metro just for everyone to see. I follow their Facebook page and I saw how they prepare these plants. I saw one video where there were about six people carrying the giant plants. So, hindi po talaga madali mag-organize ng gaitong kalaking event. So, thank you so much to the Arid and Aroids team, especially to Mr. Boyd Ganigan, who even entertained and answered my questions for this video. Kala Direk and everyone else from the team, thank you and congratulations for a very successful event. By the way, I'll put their Facebook page linked below if you want to check out the other plants they have. They also specialize in you know, variegated sansevierias and other rare ornamental plants. And I chatted with Sir Boyet and he mentioned that they can export plants abroad. But you know, I just don't know the technicalities behind it. So you know, just check out their Facebook page guys. Also special thanks to April of Seeds and Stories PH who invited me to uh, join her to check out the festival and also to Patrick, thank you. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's episode. If you have questions, comments, you know what to do, just feel free to do so in the comment section below. And also, I hope you like this video and if you do, please hit on like and also hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to my channel for more planty related videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!
Oh, 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 oh,